was a beautiful Sunday evening at Peppa's house. Mommy and Daddy Pig were having their yummy tea. And Grandpa Pig was upstairs with the children. It was bedtime. He was going to read them a bedtime story. My little piggy, would you like Grandpa Pig to read you a bedtime story? Of course we do, Grandpa Pig. Peppa Pig and Georgie Pig quickly got up and went to their beds, waiting patiently for Grandpa Pig's story. Oh, 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 the book that I'm going to read tonight for you, my little piggies, it's called Peppa Pig and their treasure chest. Peppa Pig and the Treasure Hunt Peppa Pig and her little brother George are very excited. They're going to spend the day with Granny and Grandpa Pig. Off we go, says Daddy Pig. Hello, Peppa. Hello, George, says Granny. Ahoy there, my hearty, says Grandpa. We have a surprise for you, Granny and Grandpa Pig say. Yay! Peppa and George love surprises. It's a treasure hunt, says Granny Pig. Grandpa buried treasure somewhere in the yard. It's up to you to find it. Ooh. Treasure! George wants to find it. Peppa wants to find it too. Peppa has never searched for treasure before. How do we find it? He asks. Follow the map, says Granny. Hooray, Whoa. says Peppa. Grandpa Pig gives George the pirate's hat. Arr, said Georgie. Something isn't quite right. I don't understand the map, says Peppa. Can you help, Daddy? Hmm, oh yes, says Daddy Pig. I'm very good with maps. Hmm, this map is difficult. You're holding it upside down, says Granny Pig. Oops, <laughs> says Daddy. Everyone laughs. <laughs> I see, says Peppa. It's easy. X marks the spot where the treasure is buried. It's right between two apple trees. But where are they? You have to find the clues, says Granny Pig. The first one is in a bottle. Ooh. Peppa and George search. They find the scarecrow. They find butterflies. They find frogs. George finds something else. That's not treasure, says Peppa. I see it, cries Peppa. She and George rush down into the yard. It's a message in a bottle. Peppa hands the message to Mommy Pig to read. This pirate has very bad handwriting, says Mommy Pig. <laughs> I can't make it out at all. <laughs> Nonsense, says Grandpa Pig. It says to find the arrows and follow them. Whoa. Peppa and George follow the arrows to the treehouse, past the chicken pop, behind the behave. They follow them up, down, and all around the yard. Peppa sees something bright and shiny on the ground. A key! <gasps> I wonder what will that unlock, says Peppa. <whistles> Peppa looks up. She points. An apple tree, she says. George points and Peppa says, Another apple tree! Daddy gets a shovel. He digs and digs and digs. 
Finally, the shovel hit something hard. What is it? asked Peppa. Daddy reaches down into the hole. A treasure chest, cries Peppa. Whoa! says George. <laughs> Peppa uses the key to unlock the chest. It is filled with shiny coins. Gold Whoa. coins, says Peppa. We're rich! These are better than gold coins, says Grandpa Pig. These coins are made out of chocolate. Ooh, says Peppa. This is the best treasure ever. Oh, I can see that my little pig is got to sleep. Oh dear. I hope you guys enjoyed my bedtime story tonight. See you next time, guys, for another bedtime story. We have to be quiet. Peppa and George are sleeping.